you. So you probably know him best from the heart-thumping, body-rocking workout. It's called Hip Hop Abs. Well, now Sean T has come up with a new weight loss challenge. There's a twist to it. He joins me now to explain. Sean, good to see you. Thanks for being with us. Good to see you, too. Thank you so much for having me here. I'm so excited to get people motivated and fit, as always. So well, the thank motivation, you. I think, is interesting here because the new website that you have is called Diet Bets. There's money involved. So when you get money involved as a motivation, I'm sure a lot of people's ears perk up. How does this work? Well, the fun thing about it is it's like you put your money where your mouth is kind of thing. But the way it works is inside of the Diet Bet website, there's posts and there's different videos and there's a whole bunch of things that keeps you accountable and fun. And of course, me there to motivate you. I'll be doing live workouts throughout the events. Um, I'll be giving away things and just really getting people to stay healthy and fit. And also, I'll be providing some really good nutrition tips. Well, that's the important part is all the details of how to actually lose the weight. But participants, from my understanding, they submit um, a certain amount of money to be a part of it, and then whoever wins or whoever loses the most weight wins the pot of cash. Is that how it goes? You got it right. That's exactly what happens. So however many people join, they put so much money into the pot. And then what happens is if you actually lose 4% of your body weight, then you share the pot with the rest of the winners. Not to be uh, pessimistic, but how do you prevent cheating? You know those people out there that are just like, oh, you know, it's cash. Well, that's the, that's the great thing about how we prevent cheating. You know, like you have to take that picture and you have to have the date on the picture whenever they send you a message that says, hey, this is what you have to, this is what you have to make it look like. And then you also take a picture of your scale. So you take a picture, it looks right down, you see the number on the scale, see how much you weigh, you submit those together, and throughout the process, we'll check up on you. Let's talk about some of the nutrition and fitness tips that you give a lot of people. Losing weight can be so difficult, especially going into the holiday season when so many people are going to be going to parties and having maybe a little extra eggnog. So what are some of the tips that you give people on your website? The one thing I tell people is don't put too much pressure on yourself. Most people want to prevent themselves from eating stuff. And I'm saying, hey, it's all about portion control. You know, you want people to feel free when they're going through these weight loss challenges. You don't want them to feel like they're in jail, right? So what you do is say, hey, if you're going to have a, a fun food, some people call it a cheat food. I call it a treat food. If you're going to have it, look, cut it in half. You know, I'm all about halfing it up, or I'm all about the 85-15 rule. 85% 85 healthy and 15% fun, and if you stay focused in your workouts, you definitely can do it. How about pacing as far as how many times to work out a week? Do you give people benchmarks, and do you give people sort of a framework to work with? Uh, great question. Well, what I do is I actually find out where they start. So if some people have been working out for a long time, I know that they can do five or six days a week. But if you're just starting, you know what, three days a week is more than sufficient. And it's also going to help you burn the calories that you weren't burning before. And you're still going to see the results. You know, you've had so much success with hip hop abs. What other projects do you have going on in the works? Well, of course, there was Insanity and T25, and now I'm so excited to let you guys know that in December, I'm coming out with Insanity Max 30, and a lot of people are so afraid of Insanity, they hear it and they try to run. Well, the great thing about Insanity Max 30 is there's no weights, no equipment. You actually use your body to get the results, and also it's only 30 minutes. But for those people who are afraid of Insanity, I'm here to tell you we have a modifier, a locked-off modifier during the workouts. And what that means, if you need to modify, you can split the screen with me, Sean T, over here acting crazy, and then <laughs> the person that's modifying. I love it. It's, it scares you to hear Insanity, but Sean T will find you wherever you are trying to hide. <laughs> Sean, great to have you. Thanks for being with us. Thank you so much. When I get to Atlanta, maybe we can do a workout together. There you go. That? You know, I love to do that. So anytime. Take care. Awesome. Thanks.